So I was, year 2004, I was here. Listen to a uh, speech by two state leaders about leadership. And this guy said, leadership is about responsibility. You believe it, but don't be, the people don't believe it. But if you think it's so critical, you should pay any price to do it. So that day changed my mind, and I called back to my uh, team and said, let's launch it within one month. If somebody has to go to the jail, I go to the jail. Who would be the second one follow me? If I go, you continue, and you go to the jail, you go continue. That was the, called the leadership determination. Any questions? Yeah, please. Hello, my name is Pablo from Costa Rica, YGL. And given your perspective of caring and being a trustee of all this, what do you do for self-care and also maybe within your company? Because earlier on, often you can cut through sleep or other things in a silly way, and you realize that if you plan for the long term, one also has to take personal care, be there mindfulness or prioritizing better. And how are you doing this and how do you promote that in your company? How, how does your experience of being a teacher in early days oh. influence how you run the business today? Oh. Yeah. Let me tell you one thing. I never thought I could be a CEO. I never thought I, later I'd become a good CEO. One of the things I learned is from teachers. As a teacher, very important the character of a teacher is the teacher always expects his students better. I want this student to become a banker, that student to become a mayor, that guy is a scientist. This is all teachers want. If you don't have this kind of thinking, it's a, it's a, it's a lousy, it's, it's a terrible teacher. A good teacher always wants the other people better. You don't want this teacher in jail, that teacher is a bankrupt, that teacher is, you know. <laughs> you know? So as a CEO, I train myself is I always want those people to join the company do better than they thought. And everything the company should do is making sure the good environment to train him to be more positive. And everything we do, this is a teacher. And teacher does not mean I know better than you are. Everything I know better than you are because I learn from others. So a teacher should learn all the time. A teacher should share all the time. A teacher should always expect the other people better than you are. And by the way, education, it's a good, ch big challenge now. If we do not change the way we teach, 30 years later, we'll be in trouble. Because the way we teach, the, the thing we talk, teach our kids, are the things that the past 200 years, it's knowledge-based. And we cannot teach our kids to compete with machine who is smarter. We have to teach something unique. That is, machine can never catch up with us. In this way, 30 years later, our kids have the chance.